Oh, this little turkey got underneath the cabinet. <sighs> I don't know if this is Hannibal or Clarice. Yeah, I have adopted two black kitties. I adopt these black kitties. They give me a warm, fuzzy feeling. And I live for these warm, fuzzy feelings. There's my pug. I think that one's Hannibal. This also gives me a warm, fuzzy feeling. These little dolls from B&B Witch, they're at my headboard. They give me a warm, fuzzy feeling. This is Grandma Spider, given to me by my priest. Put it upon my dead altar. Even on my dead altar, sometimes I get a warm, fuzzy feeling. Oh, heck. Y'all know what's in here, don't you? There's my tarantula in there. My tarantula gives me a warm, fuzzy feeling. In times where I lack faith for one I don't ever deny the Holy Spirit I am not an atheist the Holy Spirit is the mother okay now, some of you out there, when a sister is down or losing faith, y'all feel betrayed. You feel betrayed, and so you leave some really rude, nasty comments. What about Jesus? Jesus was betrayed. Yeah, I know the stories. And what happened to the betrayer? He went and killed himself. That's what he did. <clears throat> so, it's my belief that when a sister is down, you need to uplift her. If she feels like she has lost all her faith and there is no God, she has just stumbled in the complexity of duality. Because we all know, if you know the Bible, if you come from a Christian background, that the Bible describes God. Describing God, you know, the Christian, they don't believe in the goddess. However, they acknowledge the Holy Spirit. But in Christianity, they don't acknowledge the goddess. Even though you can find the goddess in the Bible. She is mentioned in there. Her temples, her worship, Artemis, Diana. We are trying to understand source through all this density we practice divinity. The Bible describes God as having loins, being very mighty. But God, the Bible also describes God with a uterus. So that's where I say I'm Wiccan, although I'm not like traditionally Wiccan, I'm more eclectic. I am a witch, but I do practice Wicca, and in Wicca we practice duality. Why? Because we are trying to understand source on a human level. You see, in understanding source, that's kind of where the line is drawn.
There has times that I have felt like there is no God. There is times I felt like that. You know, it's like a, it's a spirit that comes over you. But when I feel that, I remember, I remember some little dolls I had. I remember the paranormal experience. There is a source behind all of this. Duality is like two strands that connect us to the omnipotent source, the source of all love, creation, everything. And heaven, heaven has host. We can feel them, can't always see them, but we can feel them. And I've had too many paranormal experiences in this life even at a moment of denial that God exists because it can be very confusing at times. We try so hard to understand. The sister is losing faith. Lift her up. Let the Holy Spirit guide you and lift her up. Love and blessings.